Hi everyone, this is Gadget Trish or GT and today I'm here with another Jackson Family update. This is the last one I'm doing for 2010 so let's get right into it because it's a lot going on. First, we're going to start with Rebe Jackson. She um, had two albums. One was Reaction and one was Centipede. They finally put them on CD. So if you had the vinyl, yeah, this is a much easier way to get this into your computer for your uh, favorite MP3 player. And also her son, Austin Brown, has a single called Target Practice. That's what I opened up with. I love it. He has an album called 85 coming out very very soon so go on his website download that track i think austin is going to make the second generation proud next we have jackie jackson he comes with two nice surprises first he has a new itunes called we know what's going on they have a radio edition and of course next um edition he has a very nice sample and i think a lot of people would appreciate how he used it. Also, he has a new clothing line. So if you ever wanted a t-shirt of Jackie, Jermaine, Marlon, Tito, um, and Randy, this is one way. Plus they have these cool looking retro type Jackson t-shirts. Um, check out J5 Collections. I hope to get um, something for sure from the website. Next, we have Jermaine. Um, if you ever wanted his videos on a DVD, it's finally out. This is available on Amazon.com. So for all my Jermaine Jackson fans, go get it. Now, Michael has a lot going on. So I'll try to get through this as quickly as possible. First, we have Michael Jackson dolls. We have Thriller Hot Toys, Bad Hot Toys, uh, Billy Jean Playmates, and then they're going to have Thriller Playmates come out in about a week. So depending on your bu budget, where you live, Michael Jackson dolls are must-haves. I don't know if anyone noticed, but I've been doing a lot of videos on Thriller and Thriller products and Thriller jackets. So of course I had to get the Thriller book. Look at this cover. Oh my goodness. This is so amazing. I could like cry. Look at this. I haven't opened it yet. I'm going to wait until the holidays to unwrap this and really spend a whole day just enjoying this. Another item from Michael that I really would recommend is the 2011 calendar. Um, Hang it up in your locker. Hang it up in your office. Hang it up in your hall. But you have to have your MJ calendar. All right, my video game gamers, Michael Jackson Experience gets my thumbs up. It's different if you're coming from a different platform, but it really is fun. As a matter of fact, I didn't think I could love Michael Jackson's music anymore, but this game just took it to another level, and I really, really enjoy it. And I would recommend it to everyone who loves Michael. For all my DVD video watching fans, they have Michael Jackson Visions. I love this cover. It moves. It's really awesome. I don't know if it shows on camera, but I love it. It has all of his DVDs plus bonuses. So if you know someone that loves Michael Jackson videos or short films, as he likes to call it, must have Michael Jackson Visions. Last but not least, do not forget that Michael Jackson's website has free shipping this month if you spend about $75. Now, if you're wondering, Gadget, what can I get with the $75? For starters, you can get this cup or a t-shirt. Would you like a scarf? And last but not least, if you're throwing an MJ party, you have to have an MJ life-size cutout. How you doing? And before I go out on the Michael stuff, um, I would like to address this whole thing with the Michael Jackson CD is coming out entitled Michael. 
I'm very aware of the controversy behind this album. I heard it all, pros, cons. I don't say I agree or disagree, but this is just how I feel. In order to keep Michael's legacy alive, we have to buy the album. I would like to retract the phrase I said, we have to support the album. What I meant to say is we should support the album. I don't want to come off like I'm threatening people. We should support the album, not have to. We don't have to do anything, but we should. Back to the show. I'm not, you know, you're open to discuss your comments in the comment bar, video responses. I, I respect everyone's opinion. I already bought the album twice. I love Michael. We are part of the legacy and we need to support that album. So if you have any opinions, that's what the comment box is for. But I already brought my album and I'm really, really happy with it. So support. Finally, we're up to Janet Jackson. And don't forget, Why Did I Get Married 2 is on CD. It's on DVD and it's on Blu-ray. And no, I still do not have a Blu-ray player. But you know if it's Jackson's, I'm going to support it. So, um, get that if you know Janet Jackson fans. And don't forget she has a book coming out in a few months called Chew You. And she's also on tour. And Hong Kong was chosen first to be her first city. So, if anybody has a hookup to those tickets, now. People always ask me, Gadget, how do you know what's going on in New York all the time? Well, I belong to a lot of groups. And one group I would suggest you to join, whether you live in New York or not, is the Michael Jackson Fans of New York City. First of all, they get involved with charity. They also have events that you would have never heard about unless you were part of this group. So that is one of my resources. I was, I would... I would join. I'm very happy. Everyone's very positive, very helpful. They get the whole MJ thing. And also, they're working on something I also would like you to get involved with. And you don't have to live in New York. Um, they're trying to get Michael Jackson reinstated for the MTV Vanguard, Vanguard Awards. So please, check out this page. Find out what it's all about. Um, they're collecting pictures and signs from all around the world. It's a global event. So like I said, you don't have to be part of New York to be part of this group. So please look into that. It's on Facebook. And before I go out, if you are looking for Michael Jackson news a lot more often than what I do, because I do, you know, Jackson family news about once every six months. But I know someone who does it at least everyone so look into mj uh news i'll give you the link my man say that's subscribing if you really want to know what's going on in the world of mj and until then gadget trish is out <laughs>